I've been masturbating every night before bed ever since I was like 10 years old. I've actually never had a wet dream in my life. I was introduced to sex at a very young age. I was like molested by a crusty pedophile in Indonesia when I was six years old. And so that was like a whole thing. But my point is because I've been jacking off like every single night for so long, oftentimes when I jack off before bed, I like don't have a lot of cum or like I just don't have like the best orgasms like the most fulfilling orgasms you know because the more you do it the more you have sex the more you jack off the less fulfilling and the less like volumizing your loads are just because your sperm like generates like you know it takes time and it takes hours and days wait what wait my headphones not connected oh i'm sorry my bad I'm gonna go ahead and connect that. Is to fully, fully regenerate. Like you'll still have it, but it won't feel as good than as if you were to like take a week long break from jacking off or like take like a month long break from like having sex. Like that next time that you do it, the longer that you like hold off feels like a million times better. Now, this is crazy because lately I've been taking this supplement, right? Like literally, I'm not even lying. I've been taking this literally like for a whole month. I've been taking. Oh shit! Man, I think my headphones messed up. Shit! Fuck oh, my bad guys. I gotta go fix my thing. Shit, bro. Fuck. What's going on? My I've been masturbating every night before bed ever since I was like 10 years old. I've actually never had a wet dream in my life. I was introduced to sex at a very young age. I was like molested by a crusty pedophile in Indonesia when I was six years old. And so that was like a whole thing. But my point is because I've been jacking off like every single night for so long, oftentimes when I jack off before bed, I like don't have a lot of cum or like Sorry about that. I was trying to learn how to last longer. I've been jerking off too much. So you could hear, um, you heard the whole video. Everyone could hear it. I've been masturbating every night before bed ever since I was like 10 years old. I've actually never had a wet dream in my life. I was introduced to sex at a very young age. I was like molested by a crusty pedophile in Indonesia when I was six years old. And so that was like a whole thing. But my point is because I've been jacking off like every single night for so long, oftentimes when I jack off before bed, I like don't have a lot of cum or like I just don't have like the best orgasms like the most fulfilling orgasms you know because the more you do it the more you have sex the more you jack off the less fulfilling and the less like volumizing 
your loads are just because your sperm like generates like you know it takes time and it takes hours and days to fully fully regenerate like you'll still have it but it won't feel as good than as if you were to like take a week-long break from jacking off or like take like a month-long break from like having sex like that next time that you do it the longer that you like hold off feels like a million times better now this is crazy because lately i've been taking this supplement right like literally i'm not even lying i've been taking this literally like for a whole month I've been taking four of these a day and this company called Popstar claims that their supplements will give you bigger, better tasting loads that taste like pineapple, like no matter how often you bang, no matter how often you jack off. And so I've been taking this every single day for a whole month and I've been having literally the best orgasms of my life and I'm genuinely shocked at how much is coming out because I'm... What? Your headphones aren't connected. Wait, so it's been, yeah. you could, fuck. Man, some random weird little Indian kids started telling the cops that we was on, like, recording some weirdly sexually explicit shit. And we're like, bro, no, we not. And also, we don't even fucking know you. Why are you going to the cops when you ain't even, like, come up to me or say nothing to me? Yeah, it was some weird ass little shit. The cops asked to see the laptop, who do, see our ID, whatever. They end up letting us go because niggas ain't really do shit. It was just weird as fuck because we wasn't even there for that long. Our niggas was already on dick and shit.